Hello, my name is Steve Bowler, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at switching. Particularly within switching, we're going to be taking a closer look at multiple spanning tree protocol, otherwise known as MST, and that is 802.1s. So the first thing we need to know about MST is that it is an IEEE standard, and it is used to map VLANs to a particular spanning tree instances. So MST will allow us to set multiple VLANs into one MST instance, which in turn will help us reduce the number of BPDUs, root bridges, etc. So MST differs from per VLAN spanning tree protocol, which is the default on the switches I have in this lab are two 3550s and we can see what the the default spanning tree version is. If I do a show spanning tree summary, we can see that the switch is in per VLAN spanning tree mode, or PVST. So in this instance of spanning tree, there is, just like the name sounds, there is a VLAN for every, I'm sorry, there's an instance of spanning tree run for every VLAN created. So again, what multiple spanning tree protocol is going to allow us to do is to group particular VLANs into what's known as an instance, and that instance is going, going to run spa, spanning tree. So what we're going to do in this lab is, the first thing we're going to do is set up the switches, switch 1 and switch 2, we're going to set up the trunk link. Again, this is going to be a trunk connection between switch 1 and switch 2. We're going to run 802.1q as the trunking protocol between the switches. And what we're going to do is on switch 1, we're going to create VLANs. We're going to have VLANs 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10 in this lab. So what we're going to do is create two instances of MST and we're going to make switch one the primary for instance one which is going to hold our all of our odd VLANs so we're gonna we'll put in instance one which is going to be given one, three, five, seven, and nine. Again, switch one is going to be the primary or the root bridge, I should say, for these VLANs, for instance, instance one. And then switch two is going to be, for instance, two is going to be the primary for two, four, six, eight, and ten. So all the even and what we're going to see is when we create these instances, we'll go, we're, we are going to create these on both switches. So switch one is going to have instance one and two.